which means you have the opportunity to make up to $1,500 extra per month just by using this app. Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Paula. If you're not new here, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna tell you guys how you guys can get paid to watch videos online. You guys know that I love my survey app at a poll, but a lot of you guys tell me that it's not accessible in your country or surveys just isn't working for you and you want some other ways to make money online and this is the reason why i have this video for you guys so i found another app that you guys can basically get paid to watch a video and i love this one because it's super low effort you don't have to do much you just have to sit there and watch an ad that's typically between like 30 to about 30 seconds to about like 90 seconds depending on how long the ad is sometimes it's like two or three videos combined together to make one ad but you can actually get paid just for watching the videos and sometimes you don't even have to physically be there to watch it you can just put it in the background while you're doing something else like scrolling on instagram or while you're watching a movie so it's pretty passive in my personal opinion so i'm super excited to share it with you guys but before we get into the video do me a favor and hit the subscribe button down below we're super close to 50k subscribers and i will be doing a huge huge giveaway when we get to 50,000 subscribers so do me a favor and get us to 50,000 subscribers also comment down below on this video your age in the comment section and without further ado let's get straight into today's video so you're gonna grab your phone and I'm gonna tell you guys what app this is the app is called brand club so this is an app on the app store that you can download and start making money today when you download the app you're gonna create your account on the app so you can use an email address and they're also gonna ask you to verify your phone number so you want to make sure that you are able to verify your phone number now for people that are not in the United States or you don't have a US number, here is what I recommend you guys do. You guys can use a fake phone number, not necessarily a fake phone number, but there are apps online that will give you temporary phone numbers. So if you need a phone number, for example, for verification, because they will send you a verification code and you will have to verify the code, you can download the app Text Now, or you can just go online, like on Google, and type temporary phone number that will have an inbox. So when they send you this code, you're gonna put the temporary phone number in the app. I'm gonna send you the code. You're gonna receive the code on the inbox on your temporary phone number. I know a friend that does this. Um, basically, they don't have a US number. So what they do is that they use this temporary phone number in order to basically um, get verification. You can also get calls on this number. You can get text messages and a whole bunch of stuff So I highly recommend it. It's a great alternative if you're not in the United States And also in case you're not in the US and the app is not available in the App Store What you can do is you can download a free app called VPN in the App Store or just any VPN app in general And what that allows you to do is it allows you to change your IP address so you can say if for example if you are in Nigeria you can download a VPN on your phone and you can basically say that you are in the US and the app is gonna think that you are in the US so it's gonna be available for you to download and then when it comes to putting in your US phone number you can use the text now or just any temporary phone number on now, online to do that so back to the brand club app so you want to go ahead and click my link in the description box because when you click a link you're going to get three dollars just for using a referral link so you will get three dollars for free just for signing up with my referral link so when you download the app you're gonna see the home page as you can see you can see my available balance my available balance is $99 um, but you are only able to cash out $50 per day. So right now, even though I have $99, I can't cash it out all at once. I have to cash out $50 today and then cash out the rest of the money tomorrow. I don't know why they have the $50 limit per day 
but they do. But here's the thing. If you're cashing out $50 every single day for 30 days, that is $1,500, which means you have the opportunity to make up to $1,500 extra per month just by using this app. And it's super, super cool. So let's get into how to actually start making money on this app after you signed up you're gonna um scroll and you're gonna see there's a bunch of ways so you can make money by connecting your accounts if you have any shopping accounts like amazon or walmart or target if you connect it to this app you're gonna you're gonna get like i think a dollar or two dollars just for doing that you can get you can get paid by reviewing items um, if you buy something online and it just happens to be one item that's also available on this app You can get paid for that as well. You also get paid for watching videos Which is the purpose and the title of today's video. I chose this. I like this method the most in my personal opinion because I Love surveys. I'm a survey girl. I think surveys are amazing. I love Adipole for taking surveys but I think being able to make money just for watching videos like I scroll on TikTok pretty much every single day I'm on YouTube I'm on Instagram watching reels I'm on YouTube watching YouTube videos watching shorts so getting paid to do the things that I would naturally do it just seems like a no-brainer to me and yes it's not gonna be as entertaining as watching a TikTok video or watching a YouTube video because these are ads and it's not like something that I would necessarily watch on purpose but in my opinion if I'm getting paid to do it why not do it for example last night I was in my on my bed and I was watching Gossip Girls and while I was watching Gossip Girls I was on my phone on Brand Club and I was basically watching ads I lowered my volume all the way down so I wouldn't hear it because I didn't want to be distracted. I, d I just wanted to watch my show. So I was watching my show, but I was also watch. I mean, I was also watching ads on there with my volume all the way down so I could not hear it. And I was making money. And yesterday alone, I made about seven dollars just that night, just for watching videos. The thing is, you only get a certain amount per day. So I think you get like. 10 or 15 or something like if I click on mine right now you can see that I actually don't have any more videos because I use them all already so every 24 hours or so it refreshes and it gives you a brand new video so now I have to wait 24 hours before I can watch more videos but I think it's just a really really low effort way to make money there aren't many ways that are actually legitimately low effort that you can actually make money from which is the reason why I really really enjoy using prank club so apart from watching videos you can also make money by taking surveys which you guys know I love and I just love surveys. I think they're amazing. Taking surveys is very controversial on the internet. And typically when I make these videos, I get two different types of people that are commenting on my videos. One type of person is the type of person who loves surveys just as much as I do. And they use it and it works for them and they just love it. And then the other type of person is a person who's like, this is a waste of time or it's not working or I'm, I tried this and I made like $2, it's not worth my time. And then there's like a third type of person that's like, don't do this because they're stealing your information and they're going to sell it to people and they're going to make money off your information. And I kind of think of it as like every single app on your phone is selling your information. Instagram is selling your selling your information. If in case you don't know that, YouTube is selling your information. When you download an app, haven't you noticed when you are searching for something on Google, and for example, you're searching for a particular shoe on Google, and then out of nowhere you start getting ads on Instagram and TikTok for that shoe. Haven't you noticed that? That's because these apps are tracking the things you do on your phone. So in my personal opinion, these apps are doing it for free and they're not paying me. They're tracking my information, they're tracking my activities and what I do, but I'm not getting a single buck off of that. So if I can willingly volunteer to give my personal information, not personal information, but information that I would naturally give out to Instagram and TikTok, a lot of the thing with these apps and the complaints I get is that it's not safe. It's as safe as you make it. 
being on the internet in general is not safe. We know this, we've known this for a very long time. It's just about how safe do you want to make it. And I have like, I have a couple videos on this channel of like my do's and don'ts when using survey apps, but I think that applies to any app in general on your phone. Like don't give them information that you would, I think of it as don't give these apps information that you wouldn't give to Instagram information that you wouldn't give to TikTok or you wouldn't give to Amazon or any shopping app. Don't give them that information. Like I'm not giving them like my SSN number. I'm not telling them like my family heritage and my, my whole family secret. Like I'm giving them information that I would naturally give any of these apps anyway. So I might as well get paid for it in my personal opinion. Controversial but that's that's what I think. Just now actually I just cashed out um $50. Oh, when you cash out, I, I'm, I cash out my money through PayPal. So it's super easy to create a PayPal address. I recently made a brand new one because for the longest time I had been using my mother's PayPal account. So I recently made my own and all you need is a bank account. Like as much, as soon as you have a bank account, you can make a PayPal because you can just link your bank account your PayPal and you will need to have a US number but like I said you can go around that by using a temporary one like the one I mentioned earlier in the video but yeah it's super super easy but with PayPal they take a fee they take a dollar and fifty cents which I am still hurt about because I had to redraw the fifty dollars and when it got to my PayPal it said forty eight dollars and fifty cents and I was like, I thought I would draw $50, but the app, PayPal, takes like a transaction fee or for example, or they call it the PayPal fee, PayPal fee, and they take $50, I mean $1.50, which is kind of annoying, but it is what it is, you know? But yeah, I really enjoyed using this. I recommend you guys sign up and check it out if you guys are interested in ways to make money online. Like I said, I am doing research. I'm trying to figure out other apps I might do understand. That's the reason why I'm mentioning using a VPN and using an alternate phone number because I know that most of the videos are not in the USA and I want to help as many people as possible. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did enjoy the video, do me a favor and give this video a thumbs up. It would be greatly appreciated. The thing with the YouTube algorithm is when a video gets a lot of engagement, the algorithm pushes it out to more people. So for example, if you watch this video and you don't engage at all, like you don't like the video, you don't comment, you don't do anything, even disliking the video is an engagement. If you don't do anything, the YouTube algorithm thinks, oh, this content is not good and they will not recommend it and the video is not going to get any views. But if you watch a video and you comment on the video one or you like the video or dislike the video or share the video, the video gets pushed out. So I would really, really appreciate you guys if you guys like this video and give it a um, and comment it down below. If you guys have any questions, feel free to DM me on Instagram at truepaulabrand or comment them down below if you guys are interested. And yeah, thank you for watching and I will see you guys in my next video.